Alrighty boys, welcome back to another video. We actually have a different type of video today. We're going to be going over the chapter 2 1v1 dot Elable update and how you guys can play it today instead of waiting for it to come out globally. There's a lot of countries, especially in North America. There are no servers that are up for the game specifically and it's only on Android. So I'm going to show you guys how to play it if you guys are on PC and you guys live in one of these other countries. Alrighty. So we're going to actually head into bluestats.com first where I am right now. The link for it will be down below. And once you get here, you're going to click download bluestacks 10. You're going to download it. You're going to do the whole process of, uh, process of everything as it downloads. Now you're going to set all the terms and whatnot. Then once you have it fully installed, you're going to head into here. It should launch. Uh, you should go to home here. Make sure you go to Google Play Store and you're going to download the Google Play Store. Um, and then once you have the Google Play Store downloaded, you're actually going to go into the Google Play Store and you're going to download a VPN from there. So you can look up whichever VPN. I use Nord. They have a seven day free trial you guys can use. So if you guys want to use Nord, go ahead and do that. There's also other VPNs that are free, um, like forever and not seven day free trial. So you guys want to do that as well. That can work as well. But anyways, from the last step, boys, so after you guys head into the Google Play Store and download your VPN, you're actually going to head into your VPN, whichever uh, site it takes you to. As long as you find it, you should be able to find it within uh, this Bluestacks X under My Games, or it'll be in the regular Bluestacks when it loads up from the Google Play Store when you head back into regular Bluestacks. It should pop up there amongst your apps. So you're going to head into here. Um, so I use Italian servers, actually, for this. Um... So just set your VPN specifically to Italian. So we're actually going to head into Nord. There we go. And you're going to scroll down here. Wait until you find, you can do any eligible country. It doesn't matter whichever one is closest to you. It does work. I just used Italy uh, specifically. Alrighty boys. So after you do your VPN and connect your VPN to whichever country you wish to do so, Go to this top left arrow here you should be able to go back and it'll take you to this page specifically and before you head into the play store and try to download the game itself you're going to head into settings your system apps right here this little uh, group right here settings you're gonna head in apps then you're gonna go down you're going to head into google play store you're going to go to storage and you're going to press clear data all this does is it clears pretty much your location and your basic information for the most part. That way you can actually project yourself in that new country when the Google Play Store pits with whichever servers that you're coming up from, which is what your VPN is for. So then once you do that, you're actually going to head back. Uh, you're going to press this arrow on the top left again. You're going to head into this right here. Uh, this is Google Play Store. You're going to 1v1 LOL. Try to look for these banners. For the most part, these banners are what pop up when you look for the uh, game. That's how you know that it is the actual game and it's not just the old version. If you find the old version banners up, then that means you did it incorrectly. Try to run back to the video and do it again correctly. Make sure you clear that data so it does not save as well. But anyways, boys, that's how you download the game. Um, you should be able to play uh, straight from here. So once it loads up, if it tells you that it needs an update and it sends you back and it says play again, that means you did it wrong as well because it'll just send you back and forth i did mess up a couple times doing this so i didn't have that same problem it should just boot up the game and it should be the brand new game it had should have the new battle royale mode and everything anyways boys i just want to show you guys how to do that because i want everybody to enjoy the update not just me myself so if you guys have any questions about this uh tutorial or how to do it or anything like that try to drop it in the comment section down below i'll try to respond the best way i can but anyways boys Thank you guys for watching and I will see you guys in the next one. See ya.